Welcome back to Susie Anderson Home. Today we're sharing our ideas for creating a room or space that is exclusively your own. We'll offer our tips for designing your own custom refuge that allows you to recharge, foster well-being, learn a new hobby or reconnect with what brings you joy. We'd like to thank Skillshare for supporting this episode. The first step is to select a designated space. Ideally, this is somewhere where you can have uninterrupted you time and is conducive to a permanent setup. This could be a small area with a curtain divider, a spare bedroom, an understair nook, home office, master bathroom, greenhouse or converted shed or garage. No matter how large or small this space is, the aim is to choose a spot that is uplifting, inviting and offers a level of privacy. The space should function as a spot to retreat and focus on self-fulfillment, away from the demands and pressures of everyday life. While self-fulfillment is different for everyone, it's about dedicating time to invest in your unique passions and interests. A place where you enjoy an activity that gets you in a natural state of flow, where time seems to stand still. Once you have chosen your space, reflect on what you want the overall feel to be. Write down a list of descriptive words such as calming, vibrant, energizing, wild, natural, glam, romantic, minimal or soothing. Consider the use of colour in your space as your selection will evoke different feelings and shape your perception of the environment. Here are a few of our favourite colour combinations based on colour psychology principles. Soft pastels of muted celadon greens, duck egg blues, pale pinks, soft orange and lavender allow the eyes to soften and promote serenity, rest and joy. Warm neutrals of chalky or pure whites, woods and tans are inviting, calming, elegant and fresh. Low wavelength colours like dark green and navy blue improve efficiency, productivity and focus. Monochromatic colour schemes such as black and white will add a feeling of luxury and glamour where vibrant florals, artwork and decor pieces shine. Add to the luxe feel with metallic accents in lamp bases, accent furniture and decor items. When developing a vision for the room, tailor your approach with the space's function in mind. The end goal is to have a space that offers a constant source of inspiration and nourishment whilst having just what you need at hand so it's functional for that purpose. For a meditation corner, consider softer mood lighting, a scent for focus or relaxation, comfy flooring, low seating options and ambient music played through a boombox.
The key is to consider the activity you want to do more of. There are endless options. An art studio, potting shed, music studio, dance room, or a quiet spot for you to explore new skills and hobbies. Once you've figured out the purpose of your new space, consider the furniture you'll need. See what furnishings you already have, combining existing pieces with new or secondhand finds. Depending on how much space you have and the location of your space, furniture items may include a small sofa or armchair, a daybed, a built-in window seat, coffee table, desk and desk chair, bookshelf, project workstation or console table. Look to your local stores, flea markets, antique shops or eBay for unexpected finds and inspiration pieces. Lighting selection will be specific to your needs. If you're after a cosy retreat, natural light may not be a priority. However, if your space is for artistic pursuits, task or natural light will be necessary. Light sources can include overhead LED lighting or pendants, ideally on a dimmer, as well as desk and floor lamps or a salt crystal light for ambience. If you're utilising an outdoor space, battery operated table lamps, festoon lighting or candles and hurricanes will add illumination without the need for hard wiring. Allow your space to transport your senses by including items that activate your sense of sight, sound, scent, taste and touch. As always, we recommend including something living, something with luster and something loved. Ideas include coral, gathered botanicals, metallic accents, glass vases and chalky ceramics, coffee table books, photo frames, artworks, or a mirror to expand the space and natural light. Always incorporate greenery in the energizing form of flowers and foliage for well-being, freshness and growth. For sound, consider a good set of speakers or headphones to listen to your favorite music, online classes, audiobooks or podcasts. Curtains or shutters are also useful for muffling any sounds of traffic or other members of your household. For scent, add gentle, naturally fragranced candles made from soy or beeswax, scented flowers, room sprays, oil burners or diffusers. You'll soon associate that scent with your chosen activity and signify this as your time out zone. For taste, consider a kettle to brew some herbal tea, a small coffee machine or mini fridge with your favourite beverages, so you don't have to go to the kitchen and break away from your zone. For touch, add beautiful textural elements such as a plush and cosy throw, area rugs, feather filled comfy cushions and your favourite loungewear.
as you are styling your haven, be mindful to keep it uncluttered. It's going to be most used and enjoyed if it's welcoming, calming, and free from day-to-day -day clutter. This may mean you need to incorporate a shelving unit, storage baskets, or a chest so you can tidy away as required. This will help you maintain a refuge away from the piles of paper, laundry and dishes that often build up in other areas of the home. For a whimsical garden potting shed, combine your practical garden tools with a collection of your favourite garden accessories. Ideas include wall-mounted hats, bird feeders and cages, old maps, hanging rattan baskets, pressed botanical art, lichen branches, inspiring gardening books and rustic pots. If you're wanting to learn a new creative skill or hobby, select a space that maximises the natural available light and can be reserved solely for the purpose of creating, so you can leave it set up between projects. Include a flat workspace such as a simple trestle table, an old desk with banks of drawers for storage, or a kitchen table on casters if you need the flexibility to move it as you create. If you wish to explore new skills, deepen existing passions and get lost in creativity, then one resource that I recommend is Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community for creatives, featuring thousands of inspiring ad-free and structured classes for all skill levels. There are amazing classes on design, art, entrepreneurship, floristry, photography and more. I recently did a class called iPhone Photography how to take pro photos on your iPhone. It was an hour so well spent. Dale McManus, the presenter, is both an award-winning YouTuber and an experienced photographer and videographer. He covered all the basics of digital photography and I quickly learned so many useful tips to take my iPhone photography and editing skills to a more professional level, particularly for my social media. Normally an annual membership is less than $10 a month, but since they are supporting this video, the first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. So you can start exploring your creativity today. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you feel inspired to create a space of your own that can serve as your sanctuary. Remember when designing a home you love, the beauty is in the detail.